M0 FXB Hamtech. Welcome to my videos using the Mustachetic off grid system. And today we're looking at the Helltech Tracker, and I've got the version 1.1. This unit does have GPS built into it. The Helltech version 3 that I've got does not have GPS, but you can buy a module and add that. So let's load the firmware onto this device using the Mustachetic firmware flasher. Just looking at the back of the device, it does have a LoRa module, which is the radio part, and a GPS module with antenna connections as well. This is the, the, the firmware or the firmware link that I will provide in the description. We've got the device connected via the USB-C connection, and it does have a battery connector as well. So let's right click device manager, make sure we do have it in our COM ports. Scroll down, double click, and there it is there, not connected. So let's just double check that it's plugged into our PC. There you go. And it's USB serial device 37. So we'll just close that down. Now we'll go to the software flasher. So you select the device, and ours has got the words Helltech version 1.1 on it, Helltech tracker 1.1. So we're going to click that. Then we'll select the firmware. So I just go with the one at the top, the beta version, and then we're gonna click flash. Get this window here. I'm gonna do a fully raise and install. I'll leave the board rate and just click flash. Select my COM port at the tom top left here. Hopefully you can see that and go connect. And that's it, and away it goes. And hopefully once it reboots, now I have already connected the antenna to my device so hopefully we'll be able to get it communicating i do have my other unit here which, which is just here that you can see and hopefully we'll get them communicating quite soon and just have a bit of fun with that and there's a battery in this unit As you can see now, what message now? Now you'll see you see straight away there. It's already showing the mustastic information that we would expect to see. The next step will be to pair it with our phone so we can control it. Now this will work via wireless. Well, let's get it right. Wi via Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. Now I have connected the antenna to make sure we don't cause any damage to the unit. Let's just click the button. It says no GPS at the moment. We need to connect the GPS antenna because I haven't connected a GPS antenna. So I haven't got one. Uh, I'm going to have a little hunt round to see if I can find something that will do that job for me. So thanks for watching so far. I'll probably just show you another part of the video just where I'm pairing it to my phone. And then we're going to do more tests on this soon. Right, let's see if we can pair. So we just swipe down and we've got a available Bluetooth device. Of course, turn on your Bluetooth as the Mishtastic 5514. We're gonna tap that. Should get the code. There's your code on the front, which we're gonna type in here. So it's 980439. You can actually tell it not to keep doing this in settings, but we're gonna do it for now. Tick the box. Hopefully not get lots of messages. 98043, you need to add a nine, tick. And then click OK. Then we'll open the app. You know, once it says paired and it is saying connected, just tap the app. And then we need to select the item we're going to control, which is Mestastic, like so. And you can see it's configuring the module already. And then we select on the right here, our region, which is, well, I know it's 868. So it's a bit different there. To what I'm used to seeing, actually EU868, there it is, perfect. It reboots, it sets all that up. We've got our other item here, flashing away. Press it, as you can see, 
and we're on the long fast channel it's still up to it's still doing something now let's just go to messages now I don't think we can these are old messages from my other device uh, that's where we are now map and then settings I've no point me enabling the GPS yet. I, I, I'm just going to try it. I don't think it will, but I'm just going to try and send a message and see if it picks it up. Um, so we're just going to put that there, like so. We're just going to go, hi. Send the message. Oh, look, we have a hi. Now, the, I found that... Um, that works straight away, didn't it? I'm really pleased about that and what we got here on here. Let's quickly click through some of these settings. So I'm brand new to this unit, but I will learn it, of course. Just gonna click through, as it says, no GPS. And the other bottom one, what does that do? The bottom button, is that a reset, is it? I think that is, and the same goes for here. You've got your buttons on this unit here and here, and that reboots as well. I'm very pleased with that. I'm looking forward to setting up the, the GPS, which I'll dig out my, I do have a spare connector. I'll dig it out and connect it. I've got a GPS booster in this shack. Well, thanks for watching my YouTube channel. I just wanna see if I can send one, a message from here to this unit, and then we'll end the video. Of course, we're having loads and loads of fun. And someone said to me earlier, you know why are people bothering with this you know there's other other sort of technology out there that can do this kind of thing I was, well it's great fun and remember we are completely off grid we are completely off grid and, and that's what makes it fun who knows where that's going even if it's just from a hobby point of view i think we'll save that for another day but i'll um, catch you on air bye for now seven three all the best